YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Boba, and welcome back to another play review on the channel. Hope you guys are having an incredible day. With the release of the new team of the week, it's only right that we go ahead and test out some of the new cards. And in today's video, we're going to go ahead and take a look at none other than Cole Palmer. Palmer is an 86 rated card. He has the controlled acceleration type, left footed with four star skill moves and three star weak foot. Now, we do see a bit of versatility with the card, which is always really nice to see. He can play the center attacking mid, right mid, and right wing positions. And if we go ahead and look at his in game stats in a bit more detail, we can see that the card is pretty well rounded from an attacking perspective. The technical side to his game this early on in FC25 looks absolutely incredible. Now the physical side might lack a little bit. As you guys can see, he doesn't have the greatest of pace and then the strength and aggression is a little bit lower as well. So with the way that the card is set up, I would personally go ahead and recommend a chem style to make him even more quick and then also maybe add a bit more to his physicality. Now he does have 77 pace overall with 75 acceleration and 79 sprint speed. Not great for a midfielder. Whether you play him as a set attacking mid or out wide i would highly recommend a chem style to get the most out of his pace now the 83 shooting is going to be a huge part to his game because not only do we need him to create a lot of chances but we also need him to bag a lot of goals 87 attacking positioning and 85 finishing the finishing in and around the box should be really consistent and then he does also have 82 shot power and 81 long shots with the finesse shot play style and as you guys know this year in fc 25 just like in the previous year the finesse shot play style is still really op now the 85 passing and 87 dribbling are obviously the two standout stats for the card and i think that it's safe to say man that he is an absolute technician on the ball 88 vision 88 short pass and 84 long pass the 87 dribbling is a phenomenal stat for the card but he doesn't have the greatest of agility and balance and i feel like that's going to be very interesting to test out palmer in game does have a bit of a bigger build as well so if you do prefer like your smaller more intricate type of players he might not specifically fit your style of play but the rest of his dribbling stats are really nice man 85 reactions 88 ball control and 88 composure he does also have the four star skill moves so on the ball it might take some time getting used to but i think he can most definitely get the job done and then last but not least boys the 67 fiscal he does have 79 stamina which is okay for the start of fc 25 and then he does also have 62 strength and 61 aggression not going to be the strongest of players on the ball but he's probably going to be a little bit jamie in game now in terms of play styles he does have six different play styles the finesse shot incisive pass whip pass technical flair and first touch and as you guys can see the majority of his play styles do revolve around the technical side to his game no physical play styles which is a bit of a letdown for the card but if you do run him as a center attacking mid i think that the goal scoring ability is most definitely there and he's also going to be able to create a lot of chances he does have three player role pluses you can use him as a wide playmaker a shadow striker and then also as an inside forward and depending on which position you want to go ahead and use cole palmer in the inside forward is a really good one to go ahead and use and as of recording the video he is currently going on the market for roughly 120 000 coins although the upgrade is it anything too crazy compared to his regular rare gold card with our very first weekend league just around the corner if you end up packing him from rewards man i think that he could be a very solid player for the start if you guys do enjoy these fc25 player reviews and you want to see more of them on the channel definitely let me know by leaving a like and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is a team we're going to be using in division rivals to test out the new palmer card we're going to be playing him at the center attacking mid position in the 41212 formation so without further ado boys let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is all right boys here we are jumping into game number one using the new informed cole palmer card we are coming up against williams musiala joe linton correa sane it's a very strong team but yeah man the plan is to go ahead and use him as that shadow striker in the 41212 formation we want him to bag a few goals but we honestly just want him to create a lot of chances now first things first you guys know how we like to start off every player review and that is by testing out the cards dribbling now he doesn't have the greatest of agility and balance a bit of a bigger build in game as well well but on the ball man it's okay i think that the left stick dribbling is okay might take some time getting used to if i had to choose between left stick dribbling and r1 dribbling with the card it would probably be r1 dribbling because he does have the technical play style but it's not too bad boys let's go ahead and carry the ball forward finesse shot very early on that's good boys the finesse shot play style with the hunter camp style is just going to be so so effective for the card and we do get a rage quit now as that shadow striker he does kind of drop back a little bit when we don't have possession of the ball and i feel like that's really good for the build up palmer a little bit of left a little bit of r1 dribbling right here ball roll finesse shot again that went a little bit too much power so although you're not going to be able to score every finesse shot with him it is going to be quite consistent which is nice to see good from chuameni palmer just going to carry the ball forward signal felix to make that run it's a great ball boys we timed that perfectly we probably should have just gone for a regular shot right there but there goes that variety that you get with him going forward the chance creation is going to be huge now in the build-up man i actually really like the positioning of him i think he's sticking his position really well 
right there again the physical side letting him down just a little bit not the strongest of players on the ball now we can spring into a counter attack felix with a good run okay boys i like his passing man very accurate and very consistent making that run through the middle as well finesse out with the three star weak foot a nice little finish right there and that's exactly what we need him to do man that first pass was really accurate and then he ends up getting the goal as well now as you guys know the lb pace boost is actually really effective this year palmer doesn't have the rapid or the quick step so that's going to be interesting to test out i mean it's not bad the touch did look pretty good he just has a lot of bodies back at the moment Ooh, palmer 86 power 76 free kick accuracy for the card we do have a free kick 31st minute We'll give it a try. He is going to put someone on the line and he did move his goalkeeper. You know what, boys? If he didn't move his goalkeeper right there, that's a goal. Schwab Felix keeping the pressure up. That's nice. Palmer, great attacking positioning. Fake shot. And again, go with his left foot. Oh, it's a decent attempt, man. I actually thought we were going to score right there. Decent sprint speed and acceleration right there. He's going to have to step with one of his center backs. Palmer. Oh, the fullback got him, man. That's so unlucky. We beat both center backs and then I wanted to take an R3 touch, but he got it. Palmer, a little bit of technical dribbling right there. It's a lovely finish, man. That is exactly what we need him to do. From an attacking perspective, like a technical point of view, he can do everything really well, in my opinion. Nice. Palmer on the overlap once again. Got to test out his sprint speed a little bit more up against like these quicker center backs. Who is it? Joe Gomez up against Palmer. The decent touch, man. Gets around the slide tackle. We probably should be scoring in that situation, but a decent run forward. All right, boys, here we are jumping into our final game using the new team of the week, Palmer Card. And I must say, man, a really good center attacking mid in game. For me personally, boys, the only real letdown for the card at the moment is the fact that he isn't the quickest of players. Chouameni keeping the pressure up. Griezmann, Palmer in a very advanced position again. That's a lovely touch. Finesse shot outside of the box. Wraps it, boys. That's such a good finish. Great from Alaba. Now, let's just carry the ball forward right here. He is playing a pretty high line, so we'll just play it into Felix. And again, boys, his passing has been so accurate. Griezmann over the top into Cole Palmer. Great attacking run right there on the volley. I put a little bit too much power on that shot, and he also moved his goalkeeper. So I probably should have seen that, but another really good run forward. Now, we do have a little bit of space through the middle right here. We're going to wait for Palmer to make that run. Again, it does take him a little bit longer because of his pace. We'll go near post. A lovely finish. And with the Hunter Kemp style, man, the extra attacking positioning and finishing does go a long way. Now, we are going to maybe try to overload that right-hand side. He isn't going to really track the run. Palmer over top through ball into Dalo. That's perfect, boys. Right, to, right into his stride as well. Now, we just need a little bit of support. Griezmann, Palmer might use the acceleration boost. Nice little touch right there. Through the middle. He's got the tackle, man. That's unlucky. Chomeni, good ball into Palmer. We could maybe just signal Felix to make that run. Use his pace. Palmer with the through ball. It's right into his stride, man. That's perfect. Power shot outside of the box. It's a good save by the goalkeeper. Come on, boys. All we really need is one more goal in this game. Felix over the top. It's a great ball into Palmer. Touch around the goalkeeper. Finish. It's good, boys. Really good attacking positioning. The sprint speed a little bit better in that situation. I think if he didn't pull out his goalkeeper, he maybe would have gotten the save. But after he pulled out his goalkeeper, man, you just go around him. Now, we are moving the ball well in the second half. That's a good ball, Felix. If you would have told me that his goalkeeper would come out in that situation... Oh, it's such a scrappy goal, man. It really is. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Inform Cole Palmer card in a few games of Division Rivals. And I will say, man, a pretty solid player in game. Like I said, the technical side to his game is absolutely superb, but the physical side does lack just a little bit. And if we go ahead and dissect his in-game stats in a bit more detail, we did go ahead and give him the Hunter Kemp style. And with the Hunter Kemp style, he does have 83 acceleration and then also 87 sprint speed. And as you guys know, this year in FC25, the recovery speed on defenders is just so OP that it's a little bit more difficult to use Palmer. Now, now the 83 shooting was a phenomenal stat for the card with the hunter chem style he does have 91 attacking positioning and 93 finishing with the finesse shot play style man not only was the finishing in and around the box very consistent but his long shots were really good as well now with his 85 passing and 87 dribbling he is most definitely a technician on the ball and alongside scoring a lot of goals he can also create a lot of chances 88 vision 88 short pass and 84 long pass with the incisive pass play style was really effective and when you pair that with his 87 dribbling although it takes some time getting used to i think that you can create so many chances with him now cole palmer is six foot two he does have a bit of a bigger build in game so if you do prefer your smaller more agile type of players he might not fit your style of play but with the four star skill moves and with the rest of his dribbling stats being quite decent i think that you can still most definitely get the job done
And then last but not least, boys, the 67 physical. Now, he does only have 62 strength and 61 aggression. And I will say he wasn't the strongest of players on the ball. Overall, I'm going to go ahead and give the card like an 8.5 out of 10 rating. I really enjoyed using him as that shadow striker in the 41212 formation. The balance that you get from a technical point of view is really effective for the start of FC25. The only real letdown for the card is the fact that he isn't very quick in game. So in some situations, it is a little bit more difficult to use him. Now, as of recording the video, he is currently going on the market for roughly a hundred thousand coins and if we compare this informed card to his regular rare gold card i'm pretty sure that he just got like a plus one plus two upgrade to each stat so the change isn't drastic so i would probably just continue using his regular rare gold card if you do end up packing him from foot champion rewards that's going to be a huge w but yeah man overall a pretty solid player for the start of fc 25 like i said the technical side to his game is phenomenal the fiscal side does lag just a little bit as more people start packing him i do expect his price to drop quite a bit so if you do want to wait a little bit that's a pretty good idea but if you do have the coins and you do want to go ahead and test them out a little bit he is a pretty solid option and i would recommend them but that is going to be the end of today's video if you guys did enjoy it let me know by leaving a like comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another player review and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video i've been your boy booba and i'll catch you guys in another one very very soon peace